What's going on guys, it's your average consumer and we finally have our first episode of building the ultimate smart home and as you can tell, we are starting with the kitchen and huge shout out to Ari for hooking this kitchen up, making it look as beautiful as it does and we've got a lot of cool tech inside of here guys. But first we're gonna start off with today's sponsor and that is Brilliant Home Control. So what we've got right here guys is a smart home control and this thing is cool. So of course you see these little dials or sliders over here that controls the lights. So we can just take this, bring the lights down, turn them up. So you got all those controls, like they're dimmable lights, you know, that's what you expect. So you have a smart panel over here where you can control the lights, you can go in and see the individual settings for each one. But what's also great is that not only can you control light switches, but you can also control things like music. So we have a Sono system hooked up over here. So if we wanna play some music, I can just go in. It's cool, baby, it's cool. So right from the screen, we can control the lights and the music, and we can even control things with our voice using Amazon. Now for us, that's great because that means we no longer need to have an Amazon Echo Dot or Echo Show, whatever it may be. We don't need to have one of those on our countertops. Ari hates having things on the countertops, so that is a lifesaver. If you guys take a look right here, you'll notice it has a built-in camera. Now you might be wondering why do you need a camera in your light switch? But the thing is, if you have multiple of these, you could go ahead and use these cameras to create an intercom system. So all you have to do is hit the little intercom, select the room that you wanna reach out to, and then hit the little video, or you can even just do voice, and you see the little light come on. And this is our study, and Cookie is answering. What's up, Cookie? So you gotta hold to talk. Hey, Cookie. Anyway, you guys can see the potential there. And this thing also works with the Ring Video Doorbell, so if you wanna see what's going on outside, you actually have access to that. You can just hit the camera button right here, and then boom, you can see what's going on right from your doorbell. So you can do a ton of cool things. You can set up alarms. It even has a motion sensor, so if you want it to automatically turn on the lights when you come into a room, It'll do that and it can also turn it off after it sees no movement for about 10 minutes, whatever you wanna set it to. But if you guys wanna learn more about this, I'll of course have links down below in the description. Now, appliances are the heart of any kitchen and having smart appliances are even cooler. And what we've got right here, guys, are Samsung appliances that are absolutely game changing. So we've got the Samsung Family Hub smart fridge over here. We've also got the double oven system over here. We've got the range and we've also got the dishwasher. And what's great is that they all work together to create a very nice ecosystem. So first of all, the fridge. This thing has a smart display. We actually saw it in Best Buy, and that's how we knew we were getting old. We fell in love with this. We never thought we would freak out over a refrigerator the way we did when we saw this thing. And as you can see, we have it personalized to ourselves. Uh, we have a nice little row of pictures. You guys can see our little girl cookie over here, cookie monster. So on the screen, you can of course see widgets that you would typically want on any smart display. Now the real game changer right here, guys, is having access to apps. So you have a long list of apps over here and you can even do cool things like use this app called View Inside where you can see everything inside of your fridge right from here. And you also have access to this app, this View Inside, right from your smartphone. Uh, you can even do one thing that is really, really cool, and that is sync this up to your smart TV. So if you have a Samsung TV, maybe you're watching something in one of your bedrooms and it's a live show, you don't wanna miss what's going on, but you need to get a snack or something, or you really gotta go downstairs, you can just have whatever's playing on that screen go right to the fridge itself. I'm telling you guys, it is just crazy how it all works together with all the Samsung products. So you can even play music. This thing has speakers, it has a mic, you can activate big speed, do all that kind of stuff. Guys, the fridge is awesome, what can I say? And I think ours is pretty great. Uh, it holds a lot of food. We have this second drawer over here where we got like tons of soda, lots of drinks. We got our freezer in the bottom. 
But let's talk about some of the other cool smart appliances that we have here. Uh, right here we have what our double oven. This is the double oven, right, Ari? No, it's a microwave oven. So Ari's been the one who's like, I need this, I need that, I need this in my kitchen. So she knows all this stuff better than I do. I just know what they do really well. So we got the microwave up top, oven on the bottom. This is the double oven, right? Oh, so you have two different zones within the single oven. Oh, okay, so it's a duo. And what's cool is that you can set all the controls that you need to right from up top. So this is really awesome because for people like us who don't know how to cook that well, <laughs> we can actually just set this to whatever we need. So if we wanna do a healthy cook, we can see how to preheat it for like grilled chicken, uh, baked potato, salmon steak. Say, who eats salmon steak? That's crazy. Now I did mention how you can use these with the Smart Things app. And there's a smart control feature right here where you can access and preheat things right from the phone. So right here, we got our Galaxy S10 Plus, and you can see right from the top of the screen, right in our notification center, we can see all of the smart appliances that we have here. So like I said before, you can go ahead and check the status of each cavity, and you can even set the temperature, how long you want it to go for, start, yes, and boom. Tell me that isn't crazy. So you can do that there, and you can also do it with the range as well. You have access to everything right from the app, and they all talk to each other, so they know exactly what's going on. The statuses are all shared right here. So it makes it a very nice, cohesive environment, and you just, you really can't beat it, guys. And the cool thing about this range right here is that you have access to two zones. So this is one. So if you wanna just, I don't know, bake a little piece of lasagna or, you know, make some lasagna listen i don't know guys for all you cooks out there you know what you would do with this but you have this little area but if you need more if you need more space you have access to this entire thing so this is nice if you want to make multiple dishes uh, because you can kind of separate the temperatures so if this part needs to be a lot hotter and this one not so much you can have that kind of control here uh, we love this thing even though we've used it how many times ari zero zero times baby <laughs> But it's got the tech we need. It's there for when our parents want to cook for us. Boom. Mom and dad, <laughs> come on out. We hungry. <laughs> so obviously, Ari and I love that our appliances are all smart, but there are a couple of smaller products that are smart as well. First being this toaster from Cuisine Art. And I gotta give Marquez a shout out for putting me onto this like two years ago. Now you'll notice that there aren't any levers over here. We just have buttons. We have a little screen over here telling us just how high our setting is. Check this out. When you're ready to toast something, all you do is hit that toast button and look how it goes down all nice and calm. Oh, that's nice, guys. <laughs> and when you're ready to cancel it or maybe your toast is ready, it's not gonna do that crazy pop that freaks you out. It's nice, calm. This is a it's a fancy toaster, y'all. Pinkies up, all right? But we have some other cool things as well. Uh, over here, this is like what you come to expect. We've got a Google Home Hub. So let's say we're too far from the fridge. We wanna ask Google something. We want Google to pull up some information for us. So it is cool to have it here. I figured we gotta have one of these displays here. The Echo Show was a real, it was a really hard decision to not have the Echo Show in here because it is, Super loud, big display, sounds great, but we went with the smaller, but still very useful Google Home Hub. And we actually have these in the entire house. But right next to the Google Wi-Fi, we actually have this uh, electric tea kettle. It's a nice piece of tech because one, we don't have to have it sitting on our stove. We just have it right here, we put our water inside. And what's cool is that it has these LED lights. So when you power it on, right now it'll tell, it'll show you with the, based on the color, just how hot it is. So the hotter you get it, you'll see the different colors. So you can set the temperature that you want right from inside of here. It's nice because it's, you don't have to sit there and you know count down how long you've had a kettle on the stove. Some coffee freaks out there, I know would appreciate that. Oh gosh, Ari is gonna kill me. She wants you all to know that she is working on replacing the knobs that we have over here. They might, come in yet. they might be a little mismatched. Uh, we got a couple of them. You got a couple of them done, but they're a little bit mismatched. So for all you 
hawk-eyed folks out there. She wants you guys to know we're in the process, okay? So don't judge. And we also got the, the dishwasher over here. Uh, this is actually kind of cool. It's just a dishwasher, but when it's done washing the dishes, it'll automatically slightly open up, play a chime, and let all the steam out. Now, here's the last piece of tech that I think is really cool, but we have this cool cutting board. But what's really cool about this is this little side piece right here. So you have a digital scale built right into it. So you can just turn this on, throw something on top, and then you can see how much it weighs so you can get the exact amount when you're you know, chopping up your ingredients. You can see it in two different units. You can see it in ounces and grams. So this is nice. Ari, how often will we use this one? This is your time. No? <laughs> Mom and dad. Now we talked about all this food and food making, but what about when you're done with all that, right? Well, we got this awesome trash can over here by Simple Human. Now, what makes a trash can awesome? How can you put tech into something like this? Check this out. Open can. Boom. Magic, y'all. And this is not using Wi-Fi to activate or anything. It's just listening out for the words open can. Now, this one also has two compartments. So you have your bit for recycling. You have your normal trash over here. Now, this is an absolutely awesome trash can, but there are two things that I'm not really crazy about. One is the price tag. Uh, I think this goes for about like 200 bucks. The second thing is that it is also very, very sensitive to the uh, command. I can say almost anything and randomly have it pop open. It is extremely sensitive. It, we randomly see it just go up and down. Uh, we've kind of gotten used to it, but if that's something that's going to annoy you, you might not be too crazy about it because it does it often. But I still love my little garbage can. This thing is awesome. Uh, but I think that's pretty much all of the tech that we have in here so far. Um, but we will be adding even more things later on. This is 1.0 of the kitchen. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be the cool guy or girl that gives this video a thumbs up. And can I just give a shout out to the guy who did our kitchen and who kind of like made this thing as beautiful as it is. Huge shout out to Sing. Uh, if you guys are looking to remodel your kitchen and do some cool things, I'll have his contact information down below in the description. But till next video, guys, it's your average consumer. Peace. Ari, make me a sandwich, please.